switcheroo. Ugh. Phew. Bartleby, could you pass me an empty flower pot, please? Oh. <laughs> You're not Bartleby. Good work, little helpers. I just wonder where my big helper Bartleby went. Fishy poof crackers. Mm. Ah! It's raining! It's raining, it's pouring, and Bartleby <laughs> is snoring. <laughs> Are you forgetting what day it is today? Is it sleep on the grass day? Nope. Brush my fur day? Nope. Eat a big lunch day? No, silly. We're going to help Griselda with her gardening today. Whoa now! Stop right there. Where you think you're going with True's flowers? It's okay, B. I'm giving them to Griselda so she can add them to her garden. Aw, that's so nice. Okay, enough chatter. Let's get these flowers onto the wagon. Whoa, what was that? Ooh, it's some kind of crystal. <sighs> smells pepperminty. What kind of crystal smells pepperminty? Hmm, we might be able to tell if we clean it up a little. <gasps> Something's happening! <laughs> I don't know what just happened. I think this crystal just made your juice ball switch places with that shovel. Wow! What do you know? An actual working for real switch em a jig. Switch em a ball. Yeah, switch em a thing. Switcheroo. Switcheroo. <laughs> that's good, yeah. Yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> Have you ever seen anything so amazing? Just think of all the things we can switch. She has my ball! She has my ball! <laughs> I don't know. Ah! You're me. And you're an extremely handsome kitty cat. Switcheroo switched our bodies. I can't be a cat. What about me? How am I supposed to be a human? Or a girl? I don't know how to be either. We <laughs> have to switch not... back. <laughs> how do you hold anything with these paws? Oh, what are all these fingers for? All they do is wiggle around. When are you going to get here to help me with my garden? The Grismos are ruining everything! Help me, True! She thinks you're me. Say something. Like what? Wait, who said that? Um... Hold on, just let me get... We're on our way! See you soon! Oof. On our way? True, we can't go to Griselda's like this. We have to. We promised we'd help. Grab that crystal and we'll try and figure it out there. Okay, but the second we get there, I want to be a cat again. Oh, I don't know how you people live without fur. I'm freezing! Hmm. Put the bench where the bush is, and the bush where the bench is. Moving fast. Hmm. No, no, that's not right either. Put them back where they were. <laughs> okay, let's try switching back before we talk to Griselda. Whoa! Phew. It's hard to get a grip on anything with these paws. Who is that back there? Oh no, here she comes. Let her do all the talking. <laughs> yeah, for a change. Uh, Hello. True, Bartleby, you two sound weird. <laughs> anyway, da 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 da. Everything that's here should be there, and everything that's there should be here. And True, what are you doing? Uh, hands still dirty from, uh, gardening. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Surprise! Surprise! Aww, that's so sweet of you, True. <gasps> A crystal? <laughs> it smells like peppermint. It'll be the perfect centerpiece for my garden. True. We need the switcheroo back. Why didn't you tell her it wasn't a gift? I couldn't say anything without showing her that we switched. Grismos, put this on the top of the birdbath right away. 
It's my new centerpiece, so guard it for all you're worth. Whew. All this gardening is exhausting. Time for a beauty nap. Oh, and I want that crystal to be sparkling so I can see my face in it. So be sure to shine it every couple seconds. Thank you. Polish it. Every few seconds. Grismos, no, Oreo. Sweet stuff. Yay! Grismos, I really need that crystal back. No. -uh. But everything's getting switched. No. -uh. Uh oh. Huh? Ooh. We have to stop all this switching. Never fear. This ninja cat, um, girl, we'll get it back. Uh, Bartleby? I don't know what to do next with your body. I'm the cat. I can leap. Ninja cat, go! Ooh. A feather duster. Dirty trick. No claws, no claws! Uh, I'm used to landing on my paws. Look! The beams are going everywhere, True. Even Rainbow City. Yeah, mustard. on our own. We need some wish help. Oh, Cumulo! Hi, Cumulo. Please take us to the wishing tree. Over here, please, and bouncy wishes. You can move over here. Hi, see. Greetings, True and Bartleby. I'm just switching some of the wishes spots in the wishing tree. Ah, oh, more switching. Can't things just stay the same anymore? True. There's something wrong with your voice. You sound like Bartleby. <laughs> no, no. My voice sounds the same as always. E. <laughs> no, Bartleby. My eyes must be seeing things. My ears must be hearing things. Oh, I must be dreaming. Wishes, help me wake up, please. I can't be sleeping on the job. Ooh. Thanks, Bouncing Wish. It's okay. You're not dreaming. B and I switched bodies. Yeah, True dug up this crystal thing we call the switcheroo. And it zapped us. And now I'm a human, and she's a cat. <sighs> I miss having fur. Great gravity. What a problem this is. Come, let's sit and have a think about this. <sighs> How can the wishes help you, True? Well, first we need to get the switcheroo back from the Grismos. Griselda thinks True gave it to her as a gift, but she did not. Oh, uh, that's, that's awkward. Really awkward. But maybe a wish can help us give Griselda something else that she'll like even more. And once you get the crystal, you can switch yourselves back and everything will be normal, right? Uh, not exactly. We saw the switcheroo beams blasting towards Rainbow City. <laughs> what? Ooh, huh, landed on my feet. <laughs> <laughs> it is time to get your three wishes. Wait, True's the one who asked for the wishes, but right now I'm True. The wishing tree always knows the real true. But she will need her wish pack. All right. Huh, perfect fit. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Magic power for you and me. Wishing, 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 wish
are some great wishes, Bartleby. Uh, I mean, true. Let's check the Wishopedia. Your first wish is Snorful. This smelling wish has a very strong nose for sniffing things out. If it's strong enough to move things too, it could help us push all the switched out stuff back again. <laughs> strong sneezer too, I bet. Your second wish is Zillion, one of my favorites. It can make exact copies of things, whether you just need one copy or a hundred copies. What could I make a copy of that'll help me? <gasps> the switcheroo! I could give a copy of it to Griselda so I can get the real one back. And your third wish is... Ah, yes. Look-see. The seeing wish. It can help you spot things that our eyes can't see. Hmm. I don't know why we'd need a seeing wish. <laughs> but I'm sure I'll find some way to use it. You always do, True. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wonderful wishes with me. Ooh. You're the best, Z. Good luck, True Bartleby. Uh, you too, Bartleby, True. <laughs> oh, my! <laughs> Flowerous Magnificus. <laughs> Hello, Bee. <laughs> a, a leaping lemon yellow. Now I'm a bee. <laughs> well, I better practice my buzzing. <laughs> bzz, 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 bzz. Yay! Uh. Huh? Yeah! Ice cream break. B, we need the switcheroo first. Ice cream later. Oh, right. It's time to get it back and put a stop to all the switching. <laughs> Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Zillion. <laughs> Wish come true. Ready to go? <laughs> Hi, Grismos. I really need that crystal back. No. I'm not gonna take it. I'm just gonna make a copy. I don't care. Perfect. And we'd like one copy of the switcheroo, please. But don't copy its powers. Uh, a rested princess is a happy princess. Okay, everyone. Let's see how things are looking in my... <gasps> my crystal! <laughs> 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 Weird. Did everyone just get taller? Ah! I'm a dog. Why am I a dog? I'm really sorry, Griselda. Uh, why are you talking like true? You and your Grismos weren't supposed to have my crystal. It's a switcheroo and it switches things. And people. And cats. It switched our bodies. That's so weird. Ah! That's me. I switch bodies with my fruity canes. Ah, what's that? It, it, it's chasing me. Yeah. Whoa. The switcheroo. Right behind you, True. Got it. I'm getting paw prints all over it. Uh-oh. Oh, no. How are we going to find the real switcheroo now? Feel bad, Zillion. It's not your fault you got startled. You're a good helper. 
I can't believe I'm a dog. A really adorable dog, but a dog! Fruki, no! Poise and Grace, be a princess! Come on, Bee. We gotta find the real switcheroo. I'm with you, Troob! <laughs> this isn't my stop. Okay, things are looking really switched up around here. <laughs> Where did all these trees come from? <laughs> oh, yeah. Bee, look! I found it! Uh, true? <sighs> it's like a giant game of crystal hide and seek. How are we gonna know which one's the real switcheroo with all the copies? Well, first we'll have to gather up every last crystal there is. Okay, but how can we find all the crystals if we can't even see where they all are? We don't need to see them. We just have to smell them. Oh, yeah. They smell pepperminty. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Snorkel. Wish comes true! Hi, Snorful. I need you to find all the crystals wherever they are. They smell like peppermint. Can you sniff them out for us? good with these finger thingies. I guess that's all of them. <laughs> Thanks, Snorful. Now we gotta figure out which is the real switcheroo. Luckily, I have a system. Grab them. Nope. 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 Can I help? No, I got it. Nope. I'm cramp. I'm cramp. This is gonna take forever. There it is again. Nope. None of those crystals was the switcheroo. Maybe it's one of these. There has to be a way to find out which crystal's the real switcheroo without having to polish them all. Let's think about this. Our last wish is look-see. It can see things our regular eyes can't. Right, what's on the switcheroo that we can't see? My paw print! I left paw prints on it when I tried to grab it. That's what Luxie can search for to find the real switcheroo. That's a super incredible idea. <laughs> Let's do this. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Luxie. <laughs> Wish come oh. true. Hi, Luxie. Huh? We're looking for one special crystal that has a kitty paw print on it. Are you ready to look? Well, 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 well. Well. Hmm. Where is it? Hmm. <gasps> kitty paw print! Ninja kitty true go! <laughs> yeah! Nice tail control! You know what they say, Bee. Practice makes perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Luxie. You've been a huge help. Great job, True. Now, um, switch us back, quick. Okay, Bartleby. Whiskers. No whiskers. Tail. No tail. Kitty sense of self-importance. Uh, no tail. I'm back! <laughs> I'm so happy, B. But we've got a lot more stuff to switch around. Come on! Can we celebrate for a second? Okay. One second dance party. Okay, let's go. Let's switch a roo a thing or two. Well, 
No sense wasting all that practice. Thanks, Q Mulo. Nice switcheroo, True. <gasps> Wagging isn't fun anymore. Huh. That crystal looks so gorgeous in my garden. I didn't realize it wasn't for me. Great news, Griselda Fruki. You can have all the crystal copies. Just don't ask me to count how many there are. I can't count that high. Yay! Ah! Ah, chase them back, you! Quick, chase them back! Oh, Dr. Fruki! <laughs> Wait, tail gone, fingers back, ability to curtsy, perfect. <laughs> so, uh, what are you gonna do with that switcheroo, Drew? Well, I know the perfect spot where it won't cause any more trouble. There, safe and sound, back in the ground. <laughs> 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 Big mussy mess. Okay, Bartleby, if you were the Rainbow King, where would you want to set up my nibbles and zips party? So many choices. Um, uh, let's see, um, here! <laughs> Bartleby... What? This is the perfect spot. It's where all the snack action is. Wow, getting ready for a juice party with the king sure is making me... Thirsty? Then it's time for a sip of sweet, sweet Suzuni juice. Nectar of the gods. After you. Uh. Excuse me. Oops. Sorry, was that the last one? You just gave me a great idea. You want to use a straw like a pretend mustache? <laughs> no, silly. We can get some freshly squeezed Suzuni juice for the Rainbow King. And I know just where to get it. Yeah! Nibbles and sips, nibbles and sips. No quibbles or squabbles. We'll slurp and we'll gobble. Each crumb and each grip of those nibbles and sips. <laughs> Rainbow Guard! I'm feeling nibbly and sippy. What time does True's party start? Hmm. At 3 p.m. Lavender luck. That gives me plenty of time to get ready. Rainbow Guard, uh -huh. please polish my scepter for me. <laughs> While I practice by nibbling and sipping. There it is. Happy Farming Valley. And there's Azuni Moss Island. These islands are so beautiful. Well, hi there, True and Bartleby. Hi, Farmer Mosser. We're having a nibbles and sips party for the Rainbow King today, and we were wondering if we could have some... Fresh squeezed Zazuni juice? Wow! How did you know? That's why everyone comes to Zazuni Moss Island. It's like he can read minds. I am very impressed by this farmer. <laughs> The zingy goodness of Zazuni juice comes from the Zazuni moss we grow right here in our fields. Ah, oh, this is so... Whoa! Soft Zazuni moss. So cozy. So very softy soft. Can Zazuni moss grow anywhere, Farmer Mosser? We can only grow it on this island because it grows so fast. Watch. That is fast. Now I'll show you how this mask gets juiced. Bartleby, <laughs> come on, you silly sleepyhead. Huh? What? Oh, I'm right! Ah, uh, just one more second. Okay. Okay, I really have to stop now. And here we have our Zazuni juicer. Wow, that juicer is humongous! The Zazuni moss is scooped up and then dropped into the juicer. It squishes and stretches the moss and then twists it to squeeze all the juice out. Amazing. Is it Zazuni juice yet? Almost. Almost? 
And that is freshly squeezed Azuni juice. Enjoy. Perfect. Take as many as you like for your nibble and uh, uh, sip a thing. Wow. Thanks, Thanks Farmer Master. Anytime. Bye bye now. Huh? You don't belong there, Moss. Bartleby, come on. I'll be right with you. I should probably give this back to Farmer Mosser. Farmer Mosser? Farmer Mosser! Farmer Mosser? Farmer Mosser! <laughs> oh well, guess I'll just have to hold on to this very soft piece of moss. Super soft, soft moss of ultimate softness. Wow, so soft. All settled? Ah, you bet, yeah. Bartleby, we're home. That was a long ride. I could really use a nap. Come on, Bartleby. The king's gonna be here any minute. Ugh, fine. <laughs> okay, Moss, you just stay here until I can come back and nap on you. I'll take you back home later. Sleep tight. One last thing. Can you help me set the table, please? I sure can. You take the nibbles and I'll take the sips. Whoa! Is everything okay? Um, yes. I, I um, oh, just see a spot that needs cleaning. But I'm on it. <laughs> oh! How's it coming with the sips? Good! So far, so good! Any second now! It sure is taking you a long time to put out three juice balls. Well, I like things to be just so. All done? Hold on! <sighs> Whoa! What's all this? <laughs> Funny story. Remember all that moss we saw at the moss farm today? Well, I actually sort of brought a teeny tiny bit of it home with me. <laughs> yes, I did that. Teeny tiny? Well, it was teeny tiny when I got it, but it's not so teeny tiny now. Oh, right. Farmer Mosser told us that the moss grows really, really fast. Remember? Uh-oh, I think I slept through that part. Did I mention how wonderfully soft that moss was? <laughs> A few times. But on the bright side, now the whole house can be my bed. I'm always just seconds away from a full-on nap. Anywhere, anytime, any place. Everywhere, every time, every place. I can sleep or have a snooze on a lamp or on some boots, on a table or a door, on the fridge or on the floor. Toadstool table, that's for me. The list is endless, can't you see? Let it spread, I'll have a bed of mossy softness for my head. Anywhere, anytime, any place. Everywhere, every time, every place. Oh, moss, moss, you are so soft. That was a great song, Bee. But look how much moss grew while you were singing. It'll be hard to have a nibbles and sips party when my house is so mossy. No problem. We'll get rid of it. It grew back. That's just what happened at the farm. Okay, new plan. Let's have the party outside. We'll tidy up the moss later. Great thinking. We can keep the moss from spreading by closing all the doors and windows. Quick, Bee, close the door. Problem solved. Now we can have our nibbles and sips party outside. Yep, that moss isn't going... Anywhere? Oh. Ah. 
Uh-oh. Our little moss problem is now a big moss problem. And we're going to need some help to stop it. Some witch help. Cumulo! Hi, Cumulo. Please take us to the witching tree. Faster! The moss is spreading! Hurry! Very good. Oh, greetings, Chum Bartleby. Hi, Z. What are you doing? <laughs> We're practicing balancing. Gotcha. <laughs> Thanks, Wishes. We will work on this more later. What can I help you with, True? I'm hosting a Nibbles and Sips juice party for the king today. But I have a big Zazuni moss problem, and it seems to be getting bigger. Quarks and quasars, is it ever? Moss is spreading all over Rainbow City. All right, let's stop and have a think. <sighs> Looks like the moss is a big problem. What were you thinking, True? Well, Bartleby brought some moss back from Happy Farming Valley, and it's growing really fast. But it's so soft. <laughs> <laughs> I need some wishes to help me stop the moss from growing and spreading everywhere. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful from the wishing tree, Z. Can you show me what their powers are? I certainly can. Let us see. Ah, yes, here it is. <laughs> Whoosh is the name of your windy wish. It has respiration super capacity. Huh? That means he sucks in and blows out really strongly. <sighs> <laughs> I think there's gonna be a lot of moss to blow away. What's next? Where is... <laughs> Chilzy is a wish that can freeze things in ice. Perfect. I could freeze the moss to stop it from growing. Great idea! We'll make mossicles! <laughs> <laughs> Your last wish is twisty. It can twist things in all sorts of different ways. <laughs> I have no idea how Twisty will slow down the moss, but I'll think of something. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. <laughs> Bye, Z. Thanks for all your help. Bye. <laughs> Splendid work, Rainbow Guard. My scepter is as shiny as a star now. I'm ready to go to True's house for the nibbles and sips party. Mm -hmm. <gasps> a wall of moss? I don't think it's moss season. I can't get through it. Can you try? <laughs> Purple petunias, what a predicament. Uh, oh no! It's getting worse. If we don't stop this fast, the Rainbow Kingdom will turn into the Zazuni Moss Kingdom. Oh, terrible thing a Zazuni Moss Kingdom would be. Bartleby, you've seen what's going on around here, right? I know. 
I'm just gonna miss it so much. Oh, Bartleby. Time to get this mossy problem under control. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Woosh. Wish come true. Are you ready to huff and puff and blow the moss away? Mm-hmm. <laughs> hmm. Woosh, try harder. I know you can do it. <laughs> Whoa, wow. <laughs> Hold on. When you inhaled, the moss ripped off and went right into your mouth. Can you inhale the rest of it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Goodbye, moss! Wow! You have the suction power of a super vacuum! Great job, Woosh! Now for the inside! The inside, too? Bartleby. <sighs> okay. After you. <laughs> now let's clean up the rest of the neighborhood. I'll never forget how soft you were. So very soft. I'll get you something just as soft to sleep on. Promise? Pa promise. Okay, but I don't think you'll find anything softer than super comfy soft Suzuki. <gasps> it already reached the Rainbow Castle. Can you hold any more moss? Mm -hmm. Thanks for helping, Loosh. I'll be back to get you after you digest and get smaller again. But right now, it's time for some freezing action. Cumulo! We have to hurry to stop this moss. Okay, Chilzy, come on out. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Chilzy! Wish come true! Settle in, Chilzy, and get ready, Bartleby. It's about to get icy. Ha! Huh. Good thing I have built-in mittens. Oh. Hey! <laughs> Think Chilzy can freeze all this? We have to try. Time to freeze some moss. <laughs> it's working. The moss stopped growing. Let's keep going. <laughs> 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 Chilzy did it! Everything's frozen! And now the Rainbow Castle. Ready? Aim? Chill! You did it, Chilzy! Great job! Now back in the pack. Bartleby, I thought I wasn't going to make it to your nibbles and sips party today. We had a bit of a Zazuni moss problem, Your Majesty, but we stopped it from growing. Once we get it all shoveled up, it's nibbles and sips for all. Yay! And look, the weather couldn't be better for it. All warm and sunny. Warm? And sunny? I've got a soggy, sinking feeling about this, True. <laughs> Huh? What? Oh, 
I should have left that piece of moss back on Zazuni Moss Island. I'm sorry, True. I did this. It's all my fault. It's okay, Bartleby. We'll get things back to normal with my last wish. Twisty the Twist Wish. How can twisting stop the moss from mossing? All that wish does is twisty twist twist. I feel like we've seen twisting like this before. But where? I twisted dough into pretzels yesterday for lunch. They were delicious. Yum. Oh, wow. <laughs> really good. And I twisted a balloon into a balloon mouse for you this morning. I love that balloon mouse. Um, while it lasted. And the juicer we saw at Mosser's farm, it had a funnel that twisted the moss and made the juice. Wait a minute. Bartleby, that's it. Twisting turns Zazuni moss into Zazuni juice. The moss is gone and only juice is left. Sounds like a great plan. If anyone can get rid of this moss, it's you, true. Thanks, Rainbow King. Ready, B? Always. Except for when I'm napping. But I'm not, so yes! <laughs> Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Twisty! Wish come true! Okay, Twisty, let's Twisty twist the moss and make it go away! <laughs> Rodeo rainbows! That's great! Thanks, True. My pleasure, Your Majesty. Bow. Let's go, B. Follow me. This way. of a giant juice ball. And it's making me thirsty. <laughs> okay, everyone, get ready to sip, sip, sip. Woosh and Chilsey really helped clean up that moss, but Twisty made enough Zazuni juice for the whole Rainbow Kingdom. Mm -mm. Love that Zazuni juice. And it's great with fishy poof crackers. <laughs> okay, Twisty and Woosh, back in the pack. Cherry Jubilee, true. These nibbles and sips are superb. Thank you, Your Highness. And best of all, there's no moss left in the Rainbow Kingdom. Here, here. <sighs> Bartleby, I haven't forgotten my paw promise. I knew you wouldn't. I got you a new pillow to nap on that's just as soft as moss. <gasps> Aw, thanks, True. But there's no way a pillow could be as soft as... <laughs> Sweet dreams, B. <sighs> Yeti sitting. Next stop, Yeti Village. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Pardon B, we just left. But I can't blame you for being excited. I can't wait to babysit the Yeti triplets. Me too. Yeah, three Yeti babies equals three times the fun. Which is why I packed all my toys. I just didn't know if they'd be into squeaky toys. Or tin foil balls or silly faces. <laughs> I'm sure the Yeti babies will love your toys. Thanks for bringing them, Bartleby. And thank you, Griselda, for coming along to help. Oh, it's no problem. After all, I am a pro when it comes to babies. Look, I brought my How to Raise a Fruki book. Written by the most fabulous writer I know, me. <sighs> a whole chapter on baby talk? I'm fluent. Listen. Is little baby Bartleby excited to see the Yeti Weddies? <laughs> oh, she's good, yeah. <laughs> you are a baby expert. Mm-hmm. I raised Fruki all by myself, and he turned out perfectly. Mm. Babysitting is going to be easy. 
Right. Well, we just have to remember, though, not to actually sit on the babies, okay, Grizz? No baby sitting. Look, I have a whole chapter on how not to sit on the babies. Mm. Last stop, Yeti Village. We're here! <laughs> is going to be so great! Hey! Hi, Erg! We are so ready to babysit your fuzzy little triplets. I've got my Furky training book! And I brought all my toys! Hi, Hi Snick! Hi! Baby! Yuck! Yuck! Fluff! Aww, they're almost cute enough to be princesses. Oh, okay. The babies just had their nap. I love marble berry. And they had some numble berries. And now it's ready! Ah. And now they're ready for playtime. Did someone say playtime? <laughs> nope, not that. Not that. Nope, nope. Yes, yes. <laughs> What should we play? Fetch? Chase your tail round and round? Smother Bartleby with kisses? Brookie can play that for hours. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't you don't! Aww. No! Bye! See you at sunset! We'll make sure they're in bed by then. All right, cuties. Who's ready for some true tickles? Hey, where'd they go? <laughs> I have Grok! Correction, I had Grok. <laughs> Bloof, nobody touches the crown. <laughs> uh, down! Heel! <laughs> okay, Grok, that's a good girl. Uncle Barnaby, so I'm getting a little tired. I'm just gonna put you down for a second. Okay, who wants to go for a kitty back ride? Huh? What? There you are, you silly girl. <laughs> Whoa! Phew. Way to ninja catch, Bee. <laughs> Roll over! Shake a paw! I think we should take these little bundles of fun outside. Where things are less breaky. <laughs> Who wants to go for a little carriage ride? <laughs> Wait! We need toys. My Fruki Schmookums never leaves home without his favorite chew toy. <laughs> B, what do you have? Well, let's see. I got uh, Squeaky Mousy. No. Uh, yarn Ball. A any takers? Hmm. Tough crowd. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> I know, you can't go wrong with a tinfoil ball! <gasps> the babies! They left without us! <laughs> oh, phew. Just wanted to go to the playground. Okay, who wants a push from Uncle Bartleby? <laughs> After he has a rest. Bloof, that is such a cute pose. Okay, now stay. I've got to face bubble this. Ready? Say I'm a cutie. Uh, uh, huh? Uh, 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 uh. Silly Floof, come down here. The only thing cuter than a princess is a princess with a Yeti baby. <laughs> <laughs> Nice 
walk by the river. <laughs> You're right, Drew. That sounds way less jumpy and crashy. See? Isn't this fun? <laughs> She wants to sniff around the tree. Fruki loves sniffing trees. And then he... <gasps> ah! Fruki does not do that! Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, thank you, Grok. But we should put that down now, okay? Uh, ah! Wait! I meant put it back where it was! <laughs> Good boy, Floof. Now show Grok how to play nice with trees. Uh-oh. That tree is heading for the bridge. Uh, true. That's a lot of water. We'd better go find those triplets and see what they're up to. I'm sure there's something about all of this in my How to Train Your Fruity book. Running on logs is way harder than it looks. It is. The triplets make it look so easy. They're impossible to catch, so we need a way to round them up. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree. Wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing <laughs> tree. about these wishes. Now let's see what the Wishipedia says about their powers. This is Grok 
Graplo. Hey, ho, Graplo. Ah. Graplo has mighty grabbing power. He can grab onto anything and lift even the heaviest objects. Oh, oh hey, ha, ha. Perfect. Graplo, you can help us unblock the river. Oh. Uh -huh. Your next wish is Hugsy. Oh, yeah. This is a fun one. Hugsy. Hugsy loves wrapping anyone in super tight hugs. Who doesn't love hugs? Hugs! Hugs! <laughs> Hugsy, you can help us round up the triplets. <laughs> and last, but definitely not least, we have Twisty. A super strong wish. Twisty, great to see you again. <laughs> this one is a force of nature. Twisty can twist up anything, even a strong tornado. That's incredible! I'm just not sure how twisting could help with a flood or baby eddies, but I can't wait to figure it out. Oh. <laughs> Zoo zip zap, wishes in my pack. <laughs> Whoa, let's go fix Yeti Village. Thanks, Z. Bye, Z. You're welcome. Good luck. Good job watching the babies, Griselda. Oh, no problem. You know, I always knew I was a great babysitter. But now I know I'm a fantastic carriage sitter, too. <laughs> Time for some wish power, True. You got it. Cunio, take us to the bridge, please. Time for my first wish. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Graplo! Wish come true! Hi, Graplo! See that bridge over there? Oh uh ho! -huh. There's a big tree that's stuck underneath. Can you grab onto it and pull it out? Oh uh ho! -huh. Great! Okay, Graplo, get into position. Hey ho! Uh -huh. Now! Oh, yeah. Keep trying, Graplo! Yeah. Yay! Hey, look! The water's going down! Just kiss the ground. Bye, Cubilo. See you, buddy. Graplo, that was really impressive. Up top, Graplo. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay. Cutest plumber ever. Now tuck yourself in. Okay, now to round up those babies and get them home before sunset. Where are those cute Yeti babies anyway? Huh? That didn't really answer my question. Which way did they go? Your can flew for swinging over there, and there, and over there. <laughs> okay, but where's Grok? That came from over there. Okay, okay. Don't worry, babies! Uncle Bartleby will get you down! Um, true. How is Uncle Bartleby gonna get them down? Hmm. <laughs> we'll give them something that babies love. Hugs! Time for my second wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Hugsy! <laughs> wish come true! Okay, Hugsy. These little yetis need your super huggy power. Oh, yeah! And that. Now's your chance, Hugsy. It's Cuddle O'Clock! <laughs> nice squeezing, Hugsy. You can let go now. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Grog. And now to buckle you in to make sure you stay put. Is that okay? 
Yeah, then we're back. <laughs> Here comes your. Okay, Hugsy. Time for round two. was fun, wasn't it? That's two babies down and one to go. <laughs> Hope your snuggle supply is high, Hugsy. <laughs> no need, True. Hugsy can sit this one out. My book has a whole chapter on what to do when your Fruki's off his leash. Come here, Floof. You be a good baby, Yeti. <laughs> <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> When training your Fruki, offer treats as a reward. <laughs> I've got some yummy snacky wackies. <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> Such good yetis. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Thanks for everything, Hugsy. <laughs> now tuck yourself in. <laughs> well, that's that. Now let's get these yeti babies home in bed. <laughs> You're getting sleepy already. See, I knew babysitting was going to be easy. Yeah, it's a good thing you brought your book, Griselda. And bringing your toys was a great idea, too, Bartleby. We're a pretty good babysitting team. Oh, what a wonderful sunset. I love the way it feels on my face. Huh? Sunset? And oh, look, there's Erg and Snick returning from their big day out. <gasps> Erg and Snick? I really hope they don't see that big pile of trees over there. It's messy. Pile of trees? Oh, no, we can't leave the Yeti village like this. Cleaning up trees is not in my babysitting book. Griselda Bartleby, you need to get those Yeti babies back in bed before Erg and Snick get home. But True, who's going to clean up that mess? I'll take care of those trees. Okay, okay True, we're, we're on it. it. It's time for my third wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Twisty. Wish come true! <laughs> Hi, Twisty. We need your help, and fast. You see all those trees over there? We need to clean them up before Mama and Papa Yeti get home. I know you can twist up a tidy tornado to lift them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. We'd better hurry up. Twist, Twisty! <laughs> okay, Twisty, let's put those trees down. Join Bartleby and Griselda. I'm sure they have the triplets snug in their beds by now. <laughs> okay, Twisty, now's our chance. <laughs> Whoa, oh, oh. Great job, Twisty. Thank you so much for your help. <laughs> Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. Yeah! <gasps> oh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Hi. Oh. Thanks for the fun day. You sure kept us on our toes. I hope you two had a lovely time. We had such a fun day with your little triplets. Whoa, boy, they sure do know how to play. <laughs> and good thing I was here because absolutely nothing went wrong. Here's my card. 
You got something for us? Oh, you shouldn't have. It was our pleasure. That is silly. <gasps> Frozen Sasuni juice balls. Woo! You thank you so much. much. To the best babysitting team ever. Aww! Hino <laughs> Tari Bortleby, look! It's starting! Everyone's on their way to the Funda Wanda Festival! Ooh, I'm so excited! Me too! How many events are we gonna go to? How many? All of them. The pie eating contest, the Yeti stomp dance contest, the Rainbow City bus toot salute. They all asked me to be a judge today. Wow, that sounds like a lot of stuff to do. Yeah, but I love to do a lot and help a lot. <laughs> and giggly green morning to you, True and Bartleby. Join us in celebrating all that makes Rainbow Kingdom fun and wonderful. Funda Wonder! Funda Wonder! Funda Wonder! <laughs> oh, I brought a special surprise for this year's festival. A Hinotari egg. The Hinotari mama bird lays only one egg every thousand years. What a nice thing to share with us for the Funda Wanda Festival. Oh, and speaking of the festival, True, I am a bit concerned about all the royal functions I must attend to while watching the egg. I can watch the egg for you while you do all your Funda Wanda kingly duties. Really? Why, thank you, True. <laughs> You're always so helpful. <laughs> oh, how cute. Ah, uh, True. Aren't you already busy with a bunch of events today, kind of? I am, but I can do all that and watch the egg. No problem. Thank you, True. Enjoy the Funda Wonder Festival. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. yeah, the egg is, well, an egg. But this ice cream cone <laughs> is amazement. True, check out my multi-flavored Mega Scoop Monster Cone. <laughs> Five second roll. What? Mm, two. <laughs> <gasps> That's my first event. The Rainbow City Bus Toot Salute. Mm. On your way, Judge True. Have fun. Mm. Uh oh. Eggie doesn't seem to like loud noises. I got this. You go honk it up with the buses, and I'll tootle around with Eggie here. Thanks, B. I'll be back soon. Ah, cat's work is never done. Who's my Eggie? You're my Eggie. Yeah. Oh, hello, True. Are you ready to judge the toot salute? <laughs> oh, where's the Hinotari egg? Aggie doesn't like loud noises, Your Highness. So Bartleby's watching it until I get back. Ah, good thinking. All right, buses, let's hear those toots. Nice! How lovely! And gardenias. It's beautiful. We have a toot salute winner. Congratulations. Oh my! Eggs are particularly comfortable with kitty cats. It's obvious the calming effect of a nurturing kitty cat. Hey, B. <coughs> How's Eggy doing? Over easy. <laughs> Just that, that's an egg joke. It means Eggy's fine. <laughs> oh, good. I guess I didn't have to scramble back. <laughs> oh, look at that scramble! <laughs> Good one. Hi! The Yeti Stomp Dance Contest must be starting now. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh, more loud noise? Poor Eggie. <gasps> oh, phew. You go. I'll keep egg sitting. Thanks, B. Back soon! Eggie, want a balloon? <laughs> Maybe we'll just pick a couple to tie around you. Oh, this one looks nice. No, no. Oh, look at that. That's incredible. Look at the colors on that one. That's a... Oh, oh wait a minute. That one. No, no. How about those two? Wait. Mm -mm. Mama? Maybe those ones. There. Yeah. Hold on. Balloons are floaty. What if they carried Eggie away? Oh. 
<laughs> oh. uh, what am I worried about? It's not like you're gonna... <gasps> Hatch and run away! Oh, no. <laughs> wow! We have our Yeti stomp dancing winner! <laughs> oh, right! The Rock or Critter Contest! I almost forgot! Um, I'll check in on being an Eggy right after this. Eggy! Oh, all right, you've hatched now. Um, Hatcher! Where are you? I've got balloons! Hatcher! Oh, that chick could be a million miles away by now. You know what to do, Rocky. <laughs> Step right up mm -hmm. and win a prize. Can you guess if this is a rock or a rock critter? Make the right guess and the prize is yours. <laughs> hmm, rock critter. Nope, rock. Oh. Rock critter? Awesome! Congratulations! Yay! Um, Miss True, uh, ma'am? The pie-eating contest! I forgot about that one, too. I really need to get back to Bisu. There you are! <laughs> Boy, you love corn, huh? <laughs> That's great. Hey! No tickling my nose now. <laughs> that was a tickle, I think. Nice red tail feather, by the way. Mama? Mama? No, 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 no. Stay put, little hatcher, okay? While we go find True. Hatcher? Oh, no, 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 Hatcher! Hatcher! Hey, baby! <laughs> What's wrong? Um, funny story. Um... <gasps> Yeah, just a little. Okay, a lot. It hatched a lot! And it ran away! Oh, no! I should have come back sooner! The Rainbow King is counting on me! We have to get Eggy back! I call her Hatcher now, you know, since she hatched and everything. <sighs> I promised to help out on too many things today, Bee, but I couldn't keep up. I should have never taken on the egg-sitting job, and now this happened. I'm sorry. No big deal, True. Everyone knows how much you want to help, and I'm here to help you. Thanks, B. You're the best. Now, let's go find Egg... Uh, I mean, Hatcher. <laughs> she went that way. Hatcher! What a sweet little chickie. Mama? Oh, she thinks I'm her mama. Did you see that? A kiss from Hatcher? Turns people into chicks. We've, We've got to stop, stop this. this. Follow that chick. Hatcher's speedy. You should see how fast she ate a cob of corn. She likes corn? Quick, B, grab one. Oh, Hatcher! Oh, greetings, Hinotari Chick. <laughs> Hinotari Chick! Oh, my! <laughs> oh. Mm -hmm. You okay, little fella? <laughs> True! <gasps> Bartleby! The Hinotari Chick has hatched! We know, we know! We're trying to find her! But we must do it soon. Until the Hinotari chick gets a kiss from its mother, it will keep kissing citizens. It will? Yes. And then it won't be long until everyone is turned into a chick. <gasps> Not to worry. Fortunately, I know the best way to catch a Hinotari chick. It's as simple as... Rainbow King! What is going on around here? I came to the Fun to Win a Festival to have fun. If something bad is happening, keep it away from me. Mama? <gasps> that 
Roger's searching for her mama, and she's kissing everyone in sight until she finds her. Well, we better reunite them fast. One Ninotari chick is cute, but a whole town full? Come on. We need some big time wish help. Oh, Cumulo! To the wishing tree, please! Greetings, Chew and Bartleby. Oh, what's going on with the wishes? We're celebrating the Funda Wanda Festival by playing our own games in the wishing tree. Right now, they're about to do a sack race. I'll be the judge at this event. On your mark, get set, go, wishes! Don't worry. We'll play a lot of games so that you can all get a ribbon. <laughs> now, how can the wishing tree help you, True? We have a problem, Z. The Hinotari chick hatched, and now the chick is kissing everyone and turning them into chicks. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Even worse, it's going to keep happening until we get her back to the top of Mount Tippy Tippy Top to get a kiss, kiss from, from her mom. mom. Great gravity. What a dilemma. Let's sit and have a think about this. <sighs> How do you plan to fix this problem? Well, I need a wish to help me bring all the chicks together so I can pick out the real one. Sounds good. Any other ideas? I'll need another wish to help me change them all back again. Good thinking. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing tree. Wishes a lot. Let's see what the Wishipedia says about them. Hmm. Oh, here it is. Your first wish is Tizway, a musical wish that plays music so enchanting that everyone wants to follow the wish around. That's handy. The chicks can follow Tizway's music so I can get them all together in one place. <laughs> Your second wish is Tintly. Ooh, how bold. This color wish can change the color of any object, anywhere. Hatcher likes corn. Maybe I could color the egg stroller yellow. Then Hatcher will hop back into it. The stroller could look like a big, juicy corn niblet. <laughs> <laughs> and lastly, you have Flecto. Flecto can not only show reflections in its mirror, but he can make himself bigger and smaller as well. I'm not sure how a mirror can help us round up all the chicks, <laughs> but I'll find some way for it to help. You always do. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. You two! Back to the Funda Wanda Festival, please, Cumulo! We have to find Hatcher and change everyone back! Uh, they're everywhere! You think I'm your mama? How cute! <laughs> Chicks before everyone becomes a chick. 
<laughs> I know just what to do. Find a Use good hiding spot. First wish. Okay, that's not on the same page, no. I'll herd them all together with some music. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Tisway! Wish come true! Tisway, do you know a song that these chicks might like? Uh-huh! Great! Let's hear it! Hey, it's working! But won't they just run around again? You know, when the music stops? Not if we round them up and put them somewhere! Just the place. Let's go! Yeah! Up to left, right, here we go! Okay, we've got all the chicks. Uh, but there's so many of them. Now what? Well, if we can get up a bit higher and get a better look, then maybe we can pick out the right chick. Thanks, Tisway. Great job. No cumulo! Huh? <sighs> hmm. The real one's hard to pick out. They all look the same. Yeah, they all have those big dewy eyes and cute little tails with that one little red feather. One little red feather? Yeah, just like the one Hatcher tickled my nose with. Um, B, I only see one red feather. <laughs> that must be Hatcher. Yay, B! <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> don't kiss me, don't kiss me, don't kiss me, girl! Gotcha! We are amazing! Whew. Thanks, Troop. But now what? The chicks are on the loose again. We need something to get their attention. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Like a... <gasps> a big cob of corn! What? Zazuni juice balls. Ta-da! One big kitty corn cob. But it's purple. At least it's easy to move in. Whoa! <laughs> Spoke too soon. I mean, just have to get used to it. And my second wish can help us with the color part. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Tinsley! Wish come true! Hi, Tinsley. I need to make Bartleby's disguise yellow. Just enough to make him corny. Do you think you can help? Uh-huh. Super corny. I really am. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> Thanks, Tinsley. Let's round them up again. Here, chicky chickies. I have a giant cob of corn for you. Why don't they want my delicious corn body, True? Try acting more like corn. Act more like corn? What does she mean by that? Oh, okay, here goes. Corn, 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 I'm a corn on the cob. Corn, 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 doing such a great, um, job. There, that rhymed. It's working. Too well. Run! Keep going, B. Back to where we heard of them before. Yeah, I'm running as fast as I can. Ugh. 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 You can do it! I made it! I made it! I didn't make it! Bartleby! Oh, my poor little kitty chicky! Uh-oh! Cumulo! Hurry! <sighs> Phew! Thanks, Cumulo. But now that I've lost Bartleby, I'm the only one left who isn't a baby bird. Ooh. Whoa, Griselda, you changed back? True. I do not know what's going on here. Ooh. But you better. Ooh. The puddle. Ooh. That's it. 
When the chick saw its reflection in the puddle, it changed back into Griselda. It would be a lot faster to use my mirror wish to change all the chicks back. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wicked Flecto! Wish come true! Flecto, are you ready to help me change everyone back? Mm hmm. Yeah. Great! Let's go! Hi there! Who's this cute little face I see? Huh? Hey! It works! Thanks, True! Why do I have this urge to eat corn on the cob? Hi! Ta-da! Hey, thanks. Wait! Come back, chickies! <sighs> this would be much easier with a bigger mirror. <gasps> Flecto! I need you to be bigger so every chicky can see itself. Thanks! Let's roll! Hey. <laughs> Yay! Hey. Woo. Woo. Uh, Look over here, please, chicky! Purple persimmons! I'm a king again! Here, chick, chick, chicks! Well, it's about time! Oh, my little fooky wooks! I'm my beautiful silky cat self again! True! So glad you're back, Bee! You were the last one! Everybody's back to being themselves again! Sweet! But where's Hatcher? Right here! <laughs> we must get her to her mama on Mount Tippy Tippy Top before she kisses anyone else! There's no time to waste! Oh, Mama Hino Terry Bird, we brought you a little something from the festival. Mama! <laughs> wow! Do you think it worked? Only one way to find out. May I? Thank you. You're welcome. It worked! I'm not a chick! <coughs> And me. Thanks! <laughs> <laughs> Scratch and share. I got it, I got it, I got it! Yes! Hey, Erg, wanna play? Uh-oh. How about you, Snick? Uh-oh. I don't think they're interested, Bartleby. Game on! All right, are you ready, Grok? Yes, I'm young. Prepare to be bested by my floating lotus tiger kick. Don't worry, Grok, I'll catch you. Yay! Nice catch, Grok. All right, Yerk. I guess that means we're in the middle now. Wow! Thank you. Okay, Grok. Now throw the ball to us, and Bartleby will try to catch it. And I'm ready for you. <laughs> um, still ready? Don't you want to throw the ball to us, Grok? <laughs> oh, boy. She is tougher than a stale fishy poof cracker. Come on, Grok. Don't you want to share? Sharing is caring. <laughs> B, I think it's time for a song. What do you say, Grok? Can I share a song about sharing with you? Oh, please say yes. <laughs>
That's the sharing spirit. <laughs> okay, let's play again. This time, I'll go in the middle. Bertleby, you throw to the triplets. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. Floating Lotus Striking Tiger King. Oh. Wow, Bertleby. That went really far. <laughs> yeah, maybe a little too much tiger. Not enough lotus. Hey, oh, yeah. hey, wait for us! I think I see it over here. And that's just a rock. Any luck, Drew? No, I can't find it anywhere. But watch your step, Bartleby. Hey, guys, over here! I think I found a ball. It's right next to this this stick thing. Huh? Oh! <laughs> 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 yeah, hold on. So what is this for? <laughs> no, still confused. <laughs> you know when you have an itchy spot on your back that's too hard to reach? Well, now you can scratch that itch. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, it's just a scratching stick. Huh? This isn't just any scratching stick. It's an extra special... <laughs> super duper... Oh, da, 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 da. Great scratching stick of the never-ending forest! Oh, I got one of those. See? Oh, that's good. <laughs> scratching is really important to Yetis because their big fuzzy coats get super itchy. <laughs> Yeah, I might need a cat nap. All this excitement is making me see red. I see it too, Bartleby. It's a red yeti. A red yeti? <laughs> Good sharing, Grok. <laughs> Does this mean we can sing the sharing song again? <laughs> Maybe not right now, Bartleby. I'm going to go try and talk to him. Okay, I'm here if you need me. Hi there. I'm true, and these are my friends. Can we be friends with you? <laughs> well, a fun way to be friends is to share. Want to try? See? Now you're both having fun. Ooh, da, 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 da. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah! <laughs> now everyone's having fun. We've never seen a Red Yeti before. Are you here all by yourself? Uh -uh. Oh, uh, Another Red Yeti? Oh. 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 oh, it seems like the scratching stick is a big deal to the Red Yetis, too. <laughs> Mine! 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 stick was taken. And the forest started falling apart. Hmm, maybe if we find another scratching stick, everything will go back to normal. Hey, here's a stick. Okay, stand back, True. This is a job for a kitty naughty ninja cat. <gasps> uh, Bartleby, nothing happened. What? 
Ah, hairballs. I've got a bad feeling about this. Oh, true. Thank goodness. I'm afraid we need your help. Forest critters are flooding into Rainbow City. idea why this might be happening. Well, there's a slight problem with the never-ending forest. And it's all because the red and blue yetis aren't sharing. And the scratching stick is missing. The great scratching stick of the never-ending forest is missing? Oh, dear. The forest is at peace as long as everyone is getting along. If no one is sharing and the stick is missing, everything in the forest is going to fall apart. Don't worry, Rainbow King. An eye are on it. I hope he's exaggerating. <laughs> Not exaggerating. We need wish help. Oh, Cumulo! To the wishing tree, please. Go, go, Cumulo! Thanks, Cumulo. We'll be back in a flash. There's just no waking this little guy. Z, we need help. True, Bartleby. Join the party. This forest critter just suddenly showed up at the wishing tree. It's because the forest is in chaos. And the critters all left. So they moved into the city. And onto your desk. Because the red yetis took the scratching stick. Which made the blue yetis really upset. And do you know there are red yetis? Red, living here in Rainbow Kingdom. OK, uh, there's a lot going on. Let's sit and have a think. Okay, True, how can the wishing tree help you? First, I need a way to fix the forest so that the critters can go back to their homes. Yes, that would... Ah! Oh, oh. Ah. Yes, please help these critters get back home. Then, I need a way to find the scratching stick and put it back where it belongs. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing <laughs> tree. Wishes. Now, let's see what the Wishipedia says about their powers. This is Riwi! Riwi! Good to see you again, Riwi! Remember, Riwi is a backwards wish. It can make anything go in reverse, but it only understands when you speak backwards. Right, I am? Perfect! Riwi can help put the forest back to normal. So, um, re we me help you can? Next up is Snorful. <laughs> Snorful is a smelling wish. It can find anything using its super sensitive sniffer. Snorful, I know you can help us track down the scratching stick so we can put it back where it belongs. <laughs> Just remember, Snorfle's legs are super speedy, so don't fall behind. Got it. And thirdly, we have Burrow. Burrow. Nice to meet you too, Burrow. Burrow is a mighty wish that can tunnel its way through anything. That's incredible. Hmm, I'm not sure how tunneling underground will help our problem above ground. I'm going to have to dig deep on this one. <laughs> <laughs> Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Thanks, Z. Wishing you lots of luck. 
wishing. <laughs> Good one, Z. It's true! She's gonna fix everything! Yeah! 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 Oh, I was just getting used to my fuzzy new fascinator. <laughs> Time for my first wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Oh, right. I forgot. Z said I have to talk to Riwi backwards. Um, let's see. You choose I, zoo, zap, zip, true, come, wish, Riwi, up, wake! Help to ready? Oh, you said ready to help? <laughs> me too. Um, to me. Berries back, bring. Yeah! Oh, oh, berries, we missed you. Oh, do the mushrooms now. <laughs> Right? <laughs> Worry, don't. Fault you're not it. Trying for <laughs> thanks. Pass the M back now. Really? Oh no, you're all so hungry and tired and itchy. It really does seem like the only way to get the forest back to normal is for us to find the scratching stick. But how are we gonna find it? That's where Snorfle comes in. Time for my second wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Snorfle! Wish come true! Hi, Snorfle! Snorfle! Do you think you can sniff out the scratching stick? <laughs> was the last one to use the scratching stick, so get a whiff of him. That'll put you on the right track. Quick, Bartleby! We've got to keep up with that super sniffer! Some of my fishy poof crackers. Oh, da -ba -da -ba -do. Mm -hmm. Good sharing, Bartleby. <laughs> Where's the stick? Is it behind the rocks? Hey, I think I hear something. The Red Yetis must be on the other side with the scratching stick. But True, how are we gonna bust through this wall? If we can't make it through the wall, we'll just tunnel under. Thanks for helping us with your sniffer, Snorfle. Now tuck yourself back in. It's time for my third wish. Z 
Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Burrow! Wish come true! Hi, Burrow. The scratching stick is on the other side of this rock mountain. Can you tunnel under it? Mm -hmm. Go, Burrow, go! <laughs> Right, True. There's lots of red yetis. <laughs> Hi, everyone. I'm True, and this is Bartleby and Grok. And I think you already know Erg. Hi! Hi! Yeti see, Yeti do. Aha! sharing song. You're right, Bartleby. Let's sing. Sharing is caring. Run, 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 run. Oh, 
Bartleby, and it's extra heavy today. <laughs> oh, and now I see why. Was I supposed to help with that? Hey, you, get back here. <laughs> I'm you, not I'm back gonna there. get you. <laughs> come you here, come get Bartleby. me, come on. No! How did you put the laundry on the line already, True? I thought you did it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm not a sweater. Although I am incredibly soft. Help! Bartleby. <gasps> A little helper! Hi. Please don't run off, little helper. I really want to meet you. According to the ancient legend of the Rainbow City Kitties, the little helpers keep the whole Rainbow Kingdom running. <laughs> Sweet. Thanks, little helper. I could use three more just like you. <laughs> you guys are the best! Drew, can I keep them? Can I, can I, can I, can I, can I? With a little more can I, can I, can I? Keep them? I know they're really helpful and cute, but... Please, 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 please! Love you. Uh. <laughs> okay. If you think you can take care of them. I can. I will. I love them. Yay! Come on, little helpers. Here we go. Come on. <laughs> Welcome to our lovely house. Make yourselves at home. Huh? What? Whoa. What are you doing there? Oh, that's... Oh, that's so... So thoughtful. Wow. You're busy little creatures, huh? Aw, who is a good widow helper? Who is? You are. And you. And you. And you. <laughs> I thought it was your turn to do the dishes, B. Well, they are our guests, and they do want to help. Who am I to say no? Whoops, missed. Okay, okay, here we go. Try again. <laughs> Oh, no. It's the worst ever. I have my Grismos out looking for him, but I need someone who actually knows what they're doing. Don't worry. I'll find Frookykins. Oh, <laughs> I mean Fruki. Yay! You go, True! You want me to go with you, don't you? That's okay, B. I know a few places where Fruki likes to go. You stay home and take care of your little helpers. Great! Yeah, that's good. Give that little drool factory my love when you find him. <laughs> <laughs> I will. Have fun. Oh, I will. Yeah, I'm one lucky little kitty. I wish everybody in the Rainbow Kingdom had their own little helpers like me. Yeah, that's too bad. <laughs> Toss me another one of those. <laughs> Great, thanks. wish come true. Everyone does have their own little helpers now. <laughs> this is great. Oh. Oh. <laughs> little helpers, do your thing. Little helpers, make me sing. Cleaning, tidying is how you play. Could I love it more? No way! Little helpers, keep it going. Little helpers, you are showing. Helping skills that Watching you work is such a treat, Mrs. Spot. Little helpers, cute as can be. Little helpers, fluffily, right before my very eyes, making things so organized. Little helpers, you've been great. Little helpers, maybe take a break. Time to lower the activity. Chill out, relax, like Bartleby. Little helpers, you're not true. Little helpers need more to do. I suppose there's other jobs I could mention. The dusty ceiling needs attention. Little helpers, you're over busy. Little helpers, I'm in a tizzy. I'm running out of jobs to give you. Now I don't know what to do. 
Aha! That's it! If I can just keep you guys busy outside until True gets back, she'll know what to do. Come on, little helpers! Come on, my little helpers! If I were a cute little fluffy dog, I know where I'd want to go. The park! I see Fruki! Aw, the little helpers are helping him go for a walk! Hi, Fruki kids! I mean, Fruki. Aww, your new friends are taking very good care of you. Good news, Griselda! I found Fruki with some little helpers. They were just out for a walk. Little helpers took Fruki for a walk? Hmm. Well, then bring them all home. I need little helpers to help me feed Fruki kins, give baths, brush fur, floss teeth, <laughs> bedtime stories, we'll be there polish soon. tiaras. Thanks, Camilla. I'll see you later. Let's help ourselves to a fun walk home. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Boy, I love yard chores. Did you, huh? Yeah, uh, uh, what are you guys making? <gasps> A hammock? For me? <laughs> I could get used to this. Huh? <laughs> what? Whoa! Zipline fishy poofs! Oh, you guys are so healthy! Stop, 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 stop! I'm stuffed! That's way too many fishy poof crackers! Whoa, did I just say that? What am I doing? No, 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 no. You need more stuff to help with? But you've already done everything inside and out. Up and down, all around. <laughs> I've got nothing else for you to do. Nothing. <laughs> hey, don't make a mess. Oh, now you're cleaning it up. Wait, you're making work for yourselves? <laughs> yes, you are. Um, okay, thanks, but uh, you already mowed the lawn. No, 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 you... You don't need to sweep it again. You already trimmed the bushes! The house doesn't need to be muddied and clean and muddied and clean! Stop! <gasps> Bartleby, what are the little helpers doing? Help! True! Things are going great! The helpers cleaned the house top to bottom and organized the cutlery and moved all the furniture to sweep the floors. But then they ran out of stuff to do inside, so I brought them outside to keep them busy. They mowed the lawn and emptied the garbage and made a hammock and trimmed the bushes. Did I mention they made a hammock? But then they ran out of things to clean, so they started to make their own messes just to stay busy. I can't stop them! I don't know what to do! If you need me, I'll be in my hammock. What was that? Thank you! Aww. Thank you! Aww. Aww. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Uh. <laughs> the little helpers are over helping. True, I'm getting emergency calls from all over the place. None of the big jobs around Rainbow Kingdom are getting done. Buses need to be cleaned. The fruit harvest is piling up at Happy Farming Valley. And the Rainbow City Bridge should be finished by now. What in the big blue world is happening? I have an idea. We'll try and fix it. Bartleby, we have to do something about these helpers. Yeah, but they're so great. And they really did help around the house. I mean, you know, for a while anyway. I know, B. But now we need to figure out what to do with them. And we'll need some wish help to do it. Cumulo, over here. Hi, Cumulo. To the wishing tree. Faster, Cumulo! Hi, Z. 
Greetings, Troon Bartleby. <sighs> These little helpers showed up to assist me, but when I ran out of jobs for them, they started helping. Over-helping, actually. But... <sighs> They're over-helping in every home, Z. When the little helpers run out of chores, they create messes just to keep themselves busy. Which doesn't really help. Not yet, anyways. It's more of a pain. And now the big jobs aren't getting done around the Rainbow Kingdom. So we need to round them up and get them back where they belong. Moons and stars. First things first. How can the wishing tree help? Well, the first thing you need to do is make the little helpers stop over helping. Maybe I could distract them so they focus on something else. Good idea, True. Then I can take them back where they belong so they can help the way they used to. <laughs> Which is to do all the things the kingdom counts on. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing tree. Wishes true. <laughs> Let's see what the Wishopedia says about them. Hmm. Sparkly is the name of your first wish. It's a fireworks wish that is so bright and colorful, you can't stop looking at it. Fireworks? How wonderful! How not wonderful! All that boom pop sizzle makes me jump out of my fur! <laughs> But it's the perfect wish to help me distract all the little helpers from overhelping. All right, I'll just plug my ears. Your second wish is... Ah, yes, Bloxo. It's a box that's small enough to carry your lunch or can multiply to carry a hundred lunches plus dessert. <laughs> that's great. We have lots of little helpers to gather up. Your third wish is Tizway. It plays enchanting music that everyone will flock to. Hmm, I'm not sure how I'll use that wish, but maybe the little helpers will like Tizway's music too. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Bye, Z. You're the best, Z. Come on, Bartleby. Let's get our little buddies back to their work. True, come to my castle quick. The little helpers are out of control. Be right there, Roselda. Let's go, Cumulo. Zelda? True, it keeps on getting worse. Look, the little helpers won't stop walking Froakie. And now they're doing the same thing with my Grismos. Oh no. First, it was great. The little helpers did every chore in my castle. Awesome. <laughs> but this isn't great. Why are they doing this to me, True? It's because they're not pets. They need to go back to doing what they did before. Sounds good to me. No hurry or anything. I'm kidding, hurry! Okay, Bartleby, time to use our first wish and distract them from overhelping. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Sparkly! Wish come true! Hi, Sparkly. Let's 
let's make some fireworks so that every little helper in the kingdom goes ooh and ah. Better. Ooh. Yeah. So beautiful. It really is. And not only that, now all the little helpers around Rainbow Kingdom will be distracted. <laughs> Keep going, Sparkly. While Bartleby and I gather up the little helpers with my second wish. Ready, Bloxo? Zip Zap Zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Bloxo! Wish come true! Oil. Okay, Bloxo, are you ready to carry a whole bunch of little helpers for us? Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, little helpers, over here! Look, it's the perfect place for you to watch the fireworks with all your friends. And oh my, does it need a little cleaning? You're taking all of the little helpers? I can keep just one, right? Wow. Sorry, Griselda. Well, at least I still have my Grismos. Yeah. They help. Kinda. <laughs> it's working, True. They love Bloxo. Perfect. Yeah. My box. <laughs> okay. Your box. Now to round up the other small around the kingdom. Step right up, little helpers. Best seats in the house. So many little helpers. No! All of them? Uh, not quite. But I don't know how many of them Bloxo can handle. Phew! <laughs> Poor Bloxo! Oh no! Sparkly's fireworks are fired out! Thanks, buddy. True! The little helpers! They're gonna start over helping again! I still have one wish left. Tis way. How should I use it? We need to help the little helpers get back to where they were before. <gasps> I have an idea. With Tizway's music, they'll all flock to me. Then I'll lead them all around the Rainbow Kingdom and back to the big jobs they came from. Great idea. Thanks for all uh -huh. your hard work, Bloxo. Oh. Time for a rest in the pad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And now it's time for Tizway. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Tizway! Wish come true! Let's play a follow me jamboree. Hmm, but I don't see any little helpers following us. Do you, Bartleby? Bartleby? Meow. Uh, Tizway? Oh, okay, <laughs> that was weird. If we're not sure which song to play for the little helpers, we should keep trying until we find one that works. <laughs> Yeesh, let's keep trying this way. Oh? The music's working! That's it, that's the one. Okay, everybody, let's go. Dizzy, the Rainbow City Bridge will be finished soon. I'm sure of it. 
the kingdom, things are getting back to normal again. <laughs> I'm so glad to hear that. I had no idea the little helpers did so much for us. They're so helpful. I guess this is goodbye. Don't get sappy on me now. Aw, don't feel bad, Bee. We can't keep them as pets, but they're never far away when we need a little help. I'll miss those cute little helper sounds they made. <laughs> or whatever it was that they did. <laughs> Aw, just like that. 